What's up, YouTube? It's Jake from JP Games here, bringing you guys a Yu Gi Oh! Duel Links Dark Sides of Dimension world review and tips, tricks, everything you need to know, all that good stuff. So, if you guys are excited for the video, smash the like button, smash that subscribe button, and let's get started. So, kind of go over, um, you know, we got a new dual, dual world, so pretty cool. Uh, definitely some pros, definitely some cons. Uh, we're going to go over all that, some tips, uh, some tricks, kind of everything you need to know. So, um, first off, this event is only until November 20th. So, kind of go over this. Um, what you can get in login, 1,000 gems, <coughs> Dark Magician Prismatic, 100 skill chips, which is huge, uh, some sleeves, <coughs> game mat. <coughs> I apologize, I'm sick, so if you do see... Some cuts in the videos it's so you guys don't hear me coughing but um so you get three sr tickets and three ultra tickets of different um different sorts here but the big thing make sure you get all of these because i mean it's six tickets six free tickets for logging in like come on that's that's easy so um i get that's honestly tip number one it's just log in and get the um, what's it called? Get the tickets. I'm drawing a blank. So um, again, only goes till November twentieth. Event details: get the three tickets or six tickets. Get three ultras, three uh, seekers. Get the ticket. Now, as of right now, this uh, dual world only has three characters. You got your boy Kaiba here. Fantastic your boy Mokuba, and the most pointless character of all, and my biggest hate, hate's a strong word, my biggest con on my list, Scud. Terrible, 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 don't know why you're in the game. So, go over, let's go over the uh, Kaiba character first. So, Obviously, these are the Kaiba and Mokubo versions from the movie, so so uh, you guys don't really need to read those. Um, some of the skills, so the main three skills really scorns of ultimate defeat, allows you to get chaos max and chaos form in your deck, um, can be used on turn six <coughs> and afterwards. Um, really awesome. Uh, I am disappointed this wasn't actually a physical card we can get. It's only a skill, considering we got the Chaos uh, Dark Magician. So, little... Actually, as a Boys fan, I'm extremely upset about this. So, yeah, kind of, kind of annoying that you can only use it as a skill. Especially if this stuff goes away. Ultimate Dragons, add your Boys Ultimate and your Blue Eyes to the extra deck and then your alternate evolution which you can change your blue eyes to alternate blue eyes alternative void dragon and this card is phenomenal obviously so is cast max but alternative is phenomenal again i wish as a blue eyes fan this card was in the box i would have spent my life savings on i'm just kidding just kidding but to get alternative dragon i would have spent thousands and thousands of gems but it's a skill, and I'm not sure if the skills go away and the characters go away after the event or what. So that's a little annoying. Um, only level 30 max. So those are the skills. Um, 30 max, as you guys can see, gems, gems, counter gates, really good. Um, Dragon's fighting spirit. So tip, especially if these characters are only here for a short time, level them up next mokuba uh this was really cool because mokuba actually gave us the new thunder dragon cards um so so the thunder dragon cards uh from the tcg are actually now in dual links as mokuba cards um so it's pretty cool um definitely in the rewards as well is uh, pretty cool to get get some of those um so kind of go over the level rope rewards get more gems playing for gems easy really good and if you you know thunder dragons are cool too so why not now scud this dude is straight 
garbage. Straight garbage. Like, nothing. Nothing good. None of his skills are good. None of his cards are even good. Just level him up for gems. He's only good for gems. Um, it's honestly a pointless character to add to the game, in my opinion. When you have Aigami, you have his sister that I'm drawing a blank on her name. I believe it's Sarah. So Aigami, Aigami's sister. You have, I don't know, Dark Sides of Dimension, Yugi, the main character in the movie. Why are you not in? So that's mind-blowing to me. Um, I think that's really dumb. So, especially because you add in such a pointless character in Scott. Um, now, that's not to say they won't add in any new characters. Um, I've heard rumors on Aigami, which is, he is like the main bad guy. He's all the cubics, which makes sense because you had that mysterious duelist, um, you know, that was in uh, Dark Sense of Dimensions in the Duel World. Um, that you could unlock the cubic card for, which is, I forget the exact name, which is the cubic card, so, so no need to worry about this scud, stupid scud, is this, Dusa the Meteor Cubic Vessel. So, there have been leaks that um, Aigami will be in the game, and then some more um, cubic card skills, so hopefully, hopefully they get added to the game, hopefully soon, um, so yeah, so those are kind of the characters. Mogaba Kaiba are great. Kaiba's phenomenal with its um, three skills. So phenomenal. Absolutely loved it. I think the Thunder Dragon cards are cool. So building on some an old, older archetype, which I thought was cool in the TCG as well. I'm a fan of that. Um, Scud, just pointless. Absolutely pointless. Um, so what else? Also, new box. A new new box so i personally haven't bought anything uh so it's dark dimension box 23rd main box um i just didn't personally play any of these decks so that's just me but so some main cards are the ultra rares you got uh palladium mahad chocolate magician girl so all the magician girls are in here alistair um which is phenomenal it's currently very good in the meta. Excuse me. Um, so the Alistair, Elven Saber, uh, Thunder Dragon, Chaos Sorcerer, Invocation, Neg Necro Valley. So some Gravekeeper stuff. Um, you got your Invoked. You got Quintet Magician. Uh, again, you got all your Magician girls in here. The Gadgets. Uh, Elemental Lords are in here. Um, your Invokes. Obviously, uh, Gravekeeper stuff. So, pretty cool. Um, again, just not the decks that I play. So, I didn't, um, didn't buy any. Um, so, kind of went over that. Went over the good skills. Um, go over the pros. So, pros. Kaiba skills. Fantastic. I love the Kaiba skills. Just beyond fantastic. I'm extremely happy with that. Especially as a Blue Eyes fan. Um. You know, you get new support for Blue Eyes with the skills. Thunder Dragon stuff is cool. Um, you know, obviously Thunder Dragon was one of the very good decks right off the start of the game. Uh, to add in some more uh, some more support is obviously cool as well. And then uh, more gems. So you got three characters to level up to 30 for gems. Um, speaking of Scud, garbage. Level for gems is terrible. Don't even use them. Um, now I'll go over the cons. Scud, just the whole character itself is pointless. Um, another con, I wish there was more characters, or at least you could unlock more characters right now. Um, you can only unlock Mokuba and Scud. I wish they kind of gave us like four or five characters that we could just, you know, straight up unlock. You know, even obviously by missions and stuff like that, or by level or stage. Um, but, you know, they're not hopefully coming soon, but they're not in the game right now. Um, so those are the really only two cons I have. Um, so that yeah, that's kind of it for pros and cons. Obviously some tips. Um, you know, play through it, especially if it's only here for a short time. Play through it. I believe it only goes up to level 30. So I'm only at level 20, uh, 22, 23, 23 right now, or stage. Um, 
you know, so kind of just complete this. It will allow you to obviously level up your characters, get more gems. It will, um, you know, if you use the Kaiba stuff, you're really doing well in the meta. Um, Blue Eyes the alternative is crazy. Cast Max is awesome as well. Um, and then get the tickets. You got three ultra tickets and three super tickets that all you have to do is log it. It's the easiest way to get tickets. So, um, you know, each, I mean, then you can pick who you want. So, you finish your decks, you can start new decks, all that good stuff. Get staples. Um, so, that's kind of it for the overview of the world. Um, it was kind of short, but, you know, short and sweet is the way to do everything, in my opinion. So, that's kind of it for me. If I missed anything, or if you guys have any new leaks and new information that I didn't cover, definitely comment th those uh, down below. And if you enjoyed this video and enjoyed this kind of new review overview series, smash the like button, smash that subscribe button, and Jake is out.